on the occasion of the International Women's Day 2021 and I would like to thank the team of Voice of Healthcare for inviting me for the same. COVID-19 pandemic has stretched the healthcare infrastructure of the country to a great extent and burdened the entire healthcare sector across the globe. Nowadays, the need to empower women in healthcare is more than ever. Many old-fashioned false and anti-gender equality beliefs and assumptions still exist in the healthcare sector. My message is simple. We need a 21st century approach for women's economic participation in everything. We need to, as I like to say, dare the difference to dare means to take risks, to step out of our comfort zones, to let hope, extinguish fear and courage conquer it. I have always been a strong supporter of women empowerment and strongly oppose gender discrimination at our workplace. We create awareness about the same and have strict policies in place to ensure that women are empowered and no discrimination or injustice takes place. I have always believed in standing up for the cause of welfare of women in our nation. Also, I believe healthcare is often ignored for a large number of women in our nation. We ensure that proper counselling is given to each woman on personal health and nutrition in order to take better care of themselves and their loved ones. We are also working towards healthcare, education and livelihood programs for women in rural areas by the way of camps and intervention programs. To all the young women leaders out there, ability to accept challenges and take risks, team building and having a realistic approach to things are some of the qualities one needs to have. It is never in the blood you learn from your experiences and mistakes and master your skill sets accordingly to achieve your goals. My message to all the women leaders is that each one of us should focus on adding sustainable value to the healthcare delivery system. More than exceptional growth, we should look forward to sharing more stories of operational success and its impact on the community at large. We should closely work with market-led function systems to ensure sharing of best practices, expeditious resource deployment, and reporting consistency. I am very positive and hopeful that together we can envisage a great future for the healthcare services in our country as we re-image and transform healthcare together.